Professor Paul Hunter. Stricter rules will apply across all German states as from Monday, aimed at stopping the spread of the virus. The new rules come amid continued concerns over vaccination supplies and criticism of side deals made with vaccine makers. Natalie Carney reports. The German health ministry is being asked why it made bilateral deals with at least two German COVID-19 vaccine developers parallel to a legally binding agreement not to do so between all EU nations. A ministry official speaking on condition of anonymity to the Reuters news agency stated that documents show the German government signed two deals to secure millions of additional COVID-19 vaccines. According to this report, Germany signed a bilateral preliminary agreement with the German biopharmaceutical company CureVac for some 20 million doses of their vaccine on August the 31st. Then just over a week later, it signed another independent deal for 30 million doses of the BioNTech Pfizer vaccine. According to the country's health minister, Jens Spahn, the country is set to receive upwards of 50 million doses of the new Moderna vaccine, which would be 20 million doses more than its proportional share of the EU order. At home, Spahn has faced criticism for failing to procure enough vaccines for the country's 83 million residents. As all 27 EU members are bound to EU supply deals, of which the first wasn't concluded until November, they also agreed not to make parallel negotiations to avoid competing for jabs. Yet orders from around the world have overwhelmed some developers, creating bottlenecks. BioNTech Pfizer, for example, have very clearly said that they BioNTech Pfizer made very clear early on that by the end of 2020 they could only produce 50 million doses for the entire world and that a global shortage would occur. The good news is that once we've approved other vaccine candidates there will be enough vaccines in Germany and we can offer everyone a vaccination by this summer. Germany has already vaccinated more than half a million people and is currently scheduled to receive more than 130 million doses from BioNTech and Moderna throughout 2021. Meanwhile, Germany will begin a tighter lockdown on Monday with people only allowed to meet one other person from another household. Restaurants, shops and schools will all remain closed until at least January 31st, but distance teaching and emergency care will take place. Elsewhere in Europe, the Spanish government is sending convoys carrying the COVID-19 vaccine and food supplies to areas cut off by Storm Filomena, which brought the heaviest snowfall in decades to areas across central Spain, killing four people. And France has moved forward a nightly curfew to 6 p.m. in the Mediterranean city of Marseille, following the discovery of the new variant of COVID-19 there. Natalie Carney for CGTN, Munich.